here. So today is kind of like a K beauty haul. So I have some items from okay, mainly items from Innisfree, some items from Misha, and a little bit of items from the face shop. So I'm gonna start with Innisfree first. So I picked up a ton of masks. I'm not having any makeup on because I've been working out quite a bit and also my skin has been pretty dry as well so I think I have to change my makeup and skincare routine a little bit so I picked up uh, quite a lot of the Israel Squeeze mask so uh, these are my favorite masks and it's pretty affordable as well it's like 4 ringgit a sheet so this is really good um, so I've got strawberry, kiwi, bija, tea tree, green tea, bamboo, cucumber, and aloe. Um, I got other masks that are like pretty good for like breakouts or for like skin brightening or um giving relief to my skin and moisturizing so yeah this is the mask I also pick up like this uh, like, most 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 favorite mask that I will actually splurge on I got two of the Innisfree Second Skin Mask Relief these are really really good actually these are the new um, packaging I think I've talked about them before in some previous videos so these are the new packaging and it's so good. Um, they actually use soybean fermented sheet, so it just stays on your face like really well. And you literally, it's like you feel like you're having a mask on only because of the moisture and wetness, but it really does feel like second skin. I love this. Um, this was the last one they had in stock at the store, but I would always pick this up. This is the. Juju Volcanic Blackhead Tree Snap Program. I've tried other brands before, but I always go at the industry because it's so good. Okay, other stuff I pick up from industry that I like um, masks is including the uh, industry capsule recipe pack. So they were actually having like uh, buy four free ones. So I uh, got the Capsule recipe pack aloe, which is the wash up pack, uh, one for me and one for the boyfriend. And then got the canola honey one. Uh, I believe this is the boyfriend's one as well. And then got the uh, bija and aloe sleeping pack. So this is for like when I really, really break out really badly. And um, this is a new one. I've not tried this one before. This is the a scrub pack which is red kiwi so it's supposed to exfoliate so the skin cells and repair revitalizes the skin so I'm gonna try this out um got my favorite Innisfree Green Body Multi Cleansing Tissue this is so good um smell the scent is not really strong and it fixes your makeup away like perfectly so I love this um okay so Innisfree had just brought in like their new uh, cushion line. I wouldn't say it's new, but they kind of like repackaged it a little bit. So um, they repackaged it as water fit cushion, and they still have the long white cushion. It used to be water glow cushion, so nice water fit. Like I said, my skin has been quite dry lately, so um, even my Innisfree long white cushion, which has never kicked up before, has started kicking up a little bit recently around my T zone area. My skin is just really dry, so I decided, okay, why not I take this opportunity to try the water fit cushion then. So it's supposed to be a hydrating, perfect fit cushion with juju, fresh green tea and water that feels deep hydration to your skin and fits perfectly as if your own skin when applied, leaving a clear, healthy glow. So yeah. I'm gonna try this out. It has SPF 34 and PA plus plus plus. So the SPF is kind of lower than my moisture cushion. That I believe is SPF 50 PA plus plus plus. So I'm gonna try this out. Um, if you notice, packaging is a little bit different. It's also gone cleaner. So the new cushions 
will not actually fit into your old casings. So yeah. So they were having a get get a cushion and a case and get another one for free. So I uh, as in get another case for free. So I got two cases. This is in number 34 and this is in number 31. Uh, I've got to add my color for my cushion is number 21. So this is it. So pretty and uh, this packaging. So you're supposed to fit the cushion right in here. And then I got two puffs as well. This is the and magic puff. I love their magic puffs. It's so nice. And the other cushion packaging is this one. Yeah. So, to be sure, if you hit above a certain amount, you get a free gift. So, this is my free gift form, and it's free this time, which is the Edo Rewriter Special Kit. Let me try to get it out. So, it comes with the uh, 20 ml uh, aloe white skin mist. The 15 ml aloe white sleeping pack. And also a 15 ml uh, aloe white soothing gel. I haven't actually tried the soothing gel before, so probably try it out. I quite like this sleeping pack. Uh, I haven't tried it out. Ellie White Skin Mist before. Currently, I'm using the um, the blue one. I can't remember the name right now. The Jeju something uh, Skin Mist. I've also tried the green tea one. It's the first time I have the Ellie White one. So, because it's a small size, it's a travel size, I'll probably pack this on my trips. Okay, next up is um, this tree face mask that I got from the face shop which is the Kao Kao Talk series I'm still waiting for face shop Malaysia to bring in the Kao Kao Talk Ryan series so if anybody who is in charge of face shop Malaysia if you're watching this please 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 bring it in I would really love to buy it in store and not have to resort to going through online means so yeah I would really appreciate if you guys bring it in soon I love Ryan a lot um so okay I honestly do not know the names of the Gaga Talk characters other than Ryan and I think this one is called Ponzi. Um, because I don't really use Gaga Talk to be honest. I'm more of a line user, but these are so cute. Uh, so I got this one in Brightening and this one in Resilience and this one in Soothing. Oh, that's just the uh, names of the character behind the mask. So this is Muzi, this is Neo, and this is Tube. They are like T-U-B. So those are the items from the shop. Um, because the rest of the current line of the Kappa Top series is not something I really like. It's um, kind of like um, hang. I think hand creams and perfumes, so yeah, not really my thing, so I'll try this out. Um, lastly, stuff that I got from Misha is stuff that I've been waiting for a really, really, really long time. Like from the day that I saw this series come out with Misha, I was waiting for it. I practically pestered the local Misha store in San Pyramid almost once a month ask when they bring it in. I resulted going online to get the cushion which unfortunately didn't really suit me but I got some other stuff this time so I got this really cute eyeshadow palette it's like okay look at them it's so cute so I got the corny and sally and brown and I also got this is my first ever cushion blusher actually so I got this um, brown cushion blusher in uh, the color CR02. Too cute the packaging. So I'm gonna go by numbers. So this was their first eyeshadow palette, which they call it a uh, corny pink. Come on, look at that packaging. So cute. Okay, 
so here are the colors so pretty so here it is and here it's pink and yeah so it's very 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 pretty I really really like it it's quite easy to use um, everyday colors to be honest it's bright but yeah not too bright so it's good and then the second color is the number two brown brownie so this is it again very 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 easy usable colors for everyday you can how blend both corny and brown together okay so here and it's like a darker shade this is a very pretty like copper brown color and just a light one it's really really nice um these shades actually do remind me a little bit of the Maybelline uh, nude palette but this is uh, more everyday colors whereas the Maybelline nude palette has like a spectrum of nude colors so here it is so pretty um, last but not least um, I'm glad a little bit that I've waited because they first only released a Sally and Brown eyeshadow palette and then they came out with the Sally one which is number 3 Sally Orange uh, I actually used this palette in an Instagram photo so I've actually tried it out already and it's very nice um, it's not too orangey it's almost like a orange peachy coral type of the color so shimmer and then yeah like a, kind of like a orange brown color it's like a pinkish coral and it's like an orange coral so it's really really pretty I really like it Um, so this is my first ever cushion blusher. Um, they call it the tension blusher. So this is how it looks like. It has the cutest looking puff ever. So I'm okay. actually going to open it up. So it looks like this. So I'm gonna like dab a little bit on the back of my hand. So you kind of like a little bit spread it out. They have like a little pinkish glow. So you can actually like kind of like view it up. So I'm gonna like take a little bit. Here's one a little bit more flush in the loops. As you can see, it's almost like quite a very natural pink. They have uh, four different shades for this. They have like a more coral orange, they have like an orange color, they have like a darker ish pink. Yeah, so this is quite natural actually. Um, and three stuffs from Misha include this really cute brown and sally um hand mirror so this very nice polymer and this was like the cutest thing even my boyfriend was coveting over it it come in this really really cute brown package and it's such a cute mug okay even my boyfriend was like can i have the mug and i'm like nope it's mine so yeah that's it for my little K beauty haul. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little haul video. Uh, do like, comment, subscribe, share it to your friends and family. And I will see you guys again soon. Bye bye.